Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you my latest set here. It's the LEGO Education Pneumatic Add-on Set. It is item number 9641. It has 31 pieces to this set. And basically, this is just an add-on to a couple of their larger piece sets so that you can create um, some pneumatic items. Um, the most notably for this set, I would have to say, is the pressure gauge. And that is probably the number one reason why I bought this set was to get the pressure gauge. Um, currently, the price is $59.95 US dollars. And uh, I thought it was well worth it because even one of these gauges is roughly between $20 and $27 on Bricklink. So you're ahead of the game just by purchasing this set because you end up with a lot more pneumatic pieces. Um, this is the front of the box and on the back of the box it shows you that this add-on set can be added with one of their other education sets. Um, they have item number 9632 or 9686. Um, on their website though it does say requires a simple and motorized mechanism set 779686. Um, here's an image of the website saying that. And uh, I'll actually add a link to the description above so that if you want to order this in the US, um, it'll be easy. Uh, just click on it and go. I also highly suggest you check out their website because they have a lot of other items that are great. Um, we will go ahead and open this up. Nice. Nice pile of uh, parts. Oh, a little uh, brochure here showing that the pressure gauge is fragile. <laughs> Don't drop it. Just set the parts to the side real quick and we'll just go through the booklets right here. Um, it looks like it has a bunch of booklets. Now if you buy that other set that I mentioned, um, you'll be able to build these pieces or you can actually just go through all your Lego pieces and you may have all that you need. So, um, they got a little scissor lift, a little pneumatic hand, and it looks like there's two booklets for that. And then on this booklet right here, there's two booklets for these as well. There, it looks like a little hydraulic press or pneumatic press in this case. And it looks like there's another sort of grabber as well. And this uses a bunch of the pneumatics. So there's two books for that. And then it looks like it comes with uh, instructions for building some other rather simple um, pneumatic uh, systems. And then it shows you if you have the power functions, battery box, and I guess any kind of motor. You can build a little pneumatic pump. Oh, it just looks like they uh, are showing equivalents for parts. Okay, now let's get into all the pieces. I like the clear blue translucent color to these. Now that I've had a chance to count all the hoses, you end up with four six stud long, seven at twelve studs. You end up with six at twenty-four studs. You end up with two at forty studs. 
Um, the box shows that there were supposed to be only five tees. There are actually eight in the package that I got. And then there were three valves, one air tank, one hand pump, two large cylinders, one small cylinder, and then one air pump, which can be hooked up to a power functions motor. And then most notably for the set would be the pressure gauge. This is rated up to 60 PSI or four bar. Um, I think you'll typically see the max pressure around 40 PSI or three bar roughly. You know, about 42 I've seen uh, some pneumatics get up to, at least mine. Um, this seems to be uh, designed quite well and it has a bunch of holes to fit into the Technic bricks. And uh, it looks pretty durable. Um, and I highly suggest this set to anybody who is using pneumatics over um, purchasing these items in BrickLink because for what you get, it's actually a pretty good deal as far as I see it because all the parts are brand new. Um, and not to mention, on BrickLink, they're asking just about half the price of the set just for this one item. So you're probably better off to go purchase this whole set if you want um, some good pieces in pneumatics, and especially the pressure gauge. I mean, that's why I bought the whole set. Um, I highly suggest this to anybody, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this.